Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Fire Pro Wrestling World. This is SmackDown, and we are here in the SmackDown arena as we see Billy Kay going one on one with Natalia. And, I, and then, of course, on the, in Natalia's corner is the SmackDown Women's Champion, Charlotte Flair. Now, Billy Kay won a battle royal at WrestleMania to win herself, or sorry, to earn herself a championship opportunity. And she is cashing that in at Extreme Rules against Charlotte Flair. Or sorry, not at Extreme Rules, but at uh, SmackDown before Extreme Rules, so in two weeks' time. All right, here we go. Billy Kay laying in a submission hold. Charlotte Flair taking a look, doing some opponent scouting here. Natalia is very, very skilled in the submission field as well. So Billy Kay will have her work cut out for her in this match. There's a nice follow away slam, or not follow away slam, German suplex over the top rope. Both feet landing on the floor, of course. A very nice splash to the back. Natty goes up and comes off with a splash, but gets none of it. And there's a nice suplex there by Billy Kay. And Kay with a harking on a pin. Can Charlotte keep the championship intact? If so, she will go into Money in the Bank as champion. And whoever wins the Money in the Bank match could very well challenge her that very night. So we will have a men's and a women's Money in the Bank ladder match. Er, Right, not ladder match. It's regular money in the bank match. Eight participants in each, and the winner two. Okay, the winner of the men's match will get a shot at either the Raw or SmackDown championships, and the winner of the women's match. Of course, we'll get a shot at the Raw or SmackDown Women's Championship. Cashable. Within one year. At any time. He's distracting the referee here. And nice uh, clothesline there by Natalia. Peyton Roy still distracting the referee while her partner is getting pinned. And Natty with a clothesline. Here comes a sharpshooter. 
Billy K taps out. Ladies and gentlemen, your winner is Natalia. Natty picks up a victory, a huge victory here on SmackDown. Stay tuned for more coming up. Including a main event. And ladies and gentlemen, before we get to our next match, I will explain. Last night, or sorry, two nights ago, at Backlash, Daniel Bryan defeated Kevin Owens. Clean victory, pinfall, one, two, three. So, in that case, Kevin Owens, yes, has earned himself a championship opportunity, but as of now, it is going to be a triple threat match. It will be Sheamus versus Daniel Bryan versus Kevin Owens. And tonight, Kevin Owens will face AJ Styles one on one. If Styles comes away with the victory, it will then be made into a fatal four way match. Stay tuned. All right, up next, the Ascension versus Mike Kanellis and possible new main roster call-up from NXT, Buddy Murphy. <clears throat> if Kanellis and Murphy win this match, there is a very strong possibility that Murphy will be signed to either Raw or SmackDown very soon. If not, he remains down in NXT for a while. Alright. Nice elbow there by Mike Canellis. There's a tag. And the Ascension were told that if they win this match, they will get championship, or sorry, a championship opportunity against the Balor Club, aka Luke Gallows and Carl Anderson. Stay tuned, still will come tonight. We'll see the new United States Champion in action, Andrade Cianalmas. Will be in action here tonight. And of course, our main event, Kevin Owens, one on one with AJ Styles. And if Styles wins the match, a triple threat match for the SmackDown Championship will then be made into a fatal four way. Of course, Sami Zayn had his shot last night, again, or sorry, two nights ago against The Undertaker. Undertaker won in very quick fashion therefore Sheamus decided to cash in the rematch that was owed to him and won the 
versus the rematch from the Raw Championship that was owed to him. But since he's now on SmackDown, he has decided to cash it in for the SmackDown Championship against the man known as The Undertaker. And he defeated Undertaker in a steel cage match. There we go. Murphy with a top rope elbow. There's a uh, submission hold there by Victor. There you see the Ascension, also Buddy Murphy and Mike Canellis. There's Mike accompanied by his wife Maria. There's a kick to the gut. Connor, if uh, the Ascension win, they will move on to Extreme Rules. We will get a championship opportunity. If they lose, however, the match will be made next week if the opponents will be decided next week. And this uh, knee to the back there by Connor. Already, most of the matches have been decided. There are extreme rules. There are no disqualifications in any of the matches that I have one, two, going to tell you about. Okay, so first. Oh, here we go. One, two, three. No, kick out. Alright, so first it is. For the Raw Women's Championship, Bailey one on one with Asuka. No disqualification. One, And of course, the Intercontinental title on the line. New champion, Alistair Black. One will be facing off against Baron Corbin, the, for or the former champion. The United States title on the line. Current champion, Andrade Cien Almas, will take on Bobby Roode. The SmackDown Championship. That may be made into a fatal four way tonight, but so far as a triple threat between champion Sheamus and challengers Kevin Owens and Daniel Bryan. And of course, the Raw Championship is going to be Brock Lesnar versus so it will be Brock Lesnar one on one. With Braun Strowman. Ladies and gentlemen, I am being informed that this match will be given a special stipulation that will be revealed on Raw. Actually, you know what? I'm revealing it tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, one, two, Threat, no, kick out. Ladies and gentlemen, Braun Strowman will be taking on the Raw World Champion Brock Lesnar in an MMA match. One, two, and it will take place in the Dodecagon. Oh, 
and stay tuned for that. Can Lesnar retain his Raw Championship inside the Dodecagon? One, two. All right, here we go, Buddy Murphy with a neckbreaker. And there's a senton. And there's a, oh, no, never mind. It was going to be an elbow, but it was a spin kick to the gut. says otherwise. Uh, there's a German one, two, no kick out. And Buddy Murphy is bleeding, ladies and gentlemen. He has been busted wide open. It is a wise move for him to tag into uh, out to Mike Canellis. Here we go. One. Kick out. And there's a body slam. And suplex to Victor. No one. So whoever wins this match, or uh, sorry, I will face next week's tag division match on the winner of tonight's match. One, two, kick out. Alright, and he brought out the fork, ladies and gentlemen. Both partners are now bleeding. Mike Canellis and Buddy Murphy are now bleeding. Will this affect their strategy? We will find out, I'm sure. So far, it looks to have messed them up. Uh, and then, okay, there's a nice kick there. And there's a Hollywood blockbuster. There we go. Victor puts him down. He's got a size. Uh, Maria's up on the ring apron now. Moving right back in the ring. There's what to hold to Mike Canales. Okay, ladies and gentlemen. There we go. And ladies and gentlemen, we are good to go. We have winners by the name of Mike Canales and Buddy Murphy. And next week, those two will face off and the true number one contenders will be announced at the conclusion of the match. Alright. Ladies and gentlemen, stay tuned. There, there is more coming up.
All right, ladies and gentlemen, I just realized last week that, or oh, sorry, I just realized. that last week right, stay tuned because right after this match will be Kevin Owens versus AJ Styles and if Styles wins, it is going to be a fatal four way coming up at Backlot. Alright, um, Extreme Rules. One, two, no. Anyway, that was a very nice fisherman suplex. One. Jinder Mahal.
your team championship. Buddy Murphy. Technically did not pin. Therefore, he still has to earn his way onto the roster. But he will get his chance. So Mike Canellas and a mystery partner will face Blake and Murphy next week in the winners. We'll go on to face off. There you go. The winners will go on to face Gallows and Anderson. For the SmackDown Tag Team Championship. There's a glorious DDT. One, two, three. No kick out by Gender Mahal. <coughs> Alright, and so far no matches have been made for Monday Night Raw, so but it will be a great show I'm sure. Since Braun Strowman has been named number one contender. It has been revealed that he will go one on one with Brock Lesnar inside the Dodecagon in an MMA style match. So he will be in action next week. Oh, there's a figure four. Who will he face? We will find out next week. But he will be in the main event. Oh, there's a low blow by Jinder Mahal. Bobby Roode punches him out of it. And double A Spinebuster. One, two, three, no, kick out. There's a, there's camel clutch there. Punch right to the gut, Chandra Mahal, taking a Bit of a rest. Oh, there we go. Camel Clutch, Bobby Roode taps out. He has not been doing too good lately. But he still has a championship opportunity coming up in just under three weeks' time. Alright, so that's going to do it for SmackDown, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. Please follow me on Twitter at A13ENT. Check me out on Patreon, patreon.com slash A13entertainment. And of course, as always, have a great day, night, whatever it may be for you, and stay frosty.